Hey, it's nice to have you back here in this new video. Today, I'd like to talk about a very interesting product that is a wireless microphone system designed by Fulham. And it's the audio you are hearing at this moment all comes from the Fulham 1000 Pro. It's one receiver, two transmitter. The reason why I'd like to talk about this product is that it is quite different from other wireless microphone system, not only because it built with a storage box, which will also be doubled as a charging case, and you also have plenty of other space for your uh, wireless microphone accessories, and it charges very really fast. It's a great DJI microphone alternative. It also provides with great audio performance. Another reason that I would like to talk about this 2.4 gigahertz wireless microphone system is some very unique technology behind this wireless transmission such as the adaptive frequency hopping technology that could adaptively change the frequency point or the frequency band in case your wireless transmission has been interfered by some other signals. And the other interesting technology was so-called the synchronized multi-node low latency technology that could guarantee you have a great audio video synchronization at the same time, provide premium audio performance. So all this is feature packed, and also built with some very unique wind muff, a lovelier microphone, and even more. So we're gonna cover a lot more in this video. So now let's get started. Now let's take a brief unboxing of the Fulham 1000 Pro. Pretty simple and elegant design. This is the package box, and these are actually all the things you're gonna get inside the box. A charging case, well, one receiver, two transmitter, magnet design, charging box, beautiful design, a carry case, where inside the case you get lots of cables, connectors, and some really unique accessories for this wireless microphone system. Uh, inside the user menu, you're going to figure out some really unique design in the detail. We're going to cover later in this video. Uh, and this is a Fulham 1000 Pro. This is how you can open the box. It's very simple and elegant, but there is more information on the back. On the back, not only will you see this picture of the product, but it also reveal the basic spec sheet about this wireless microphone system. Here I will take, a, if you pause on this video, and I'm gonna take a look at the basic spec sheet about this product. Well, it's a built-in 3,000 milliamp lithium battery, and it weighs only 188 grams. It looks like it's a big charging box, but it feels very light in your hand. And But more than that, you also get 7 hours battery life for the transmitter and receiver. So this is a long-lasting battery life that with great performance. And also a very interesting power management design, a strategy. You can shut down automatically after five to 10 minutes without any connection to save you time and efforts. So you don't have to worry about that. No matter you turn off the transmitter or you turn off the receiver, after a few seconds, after a few minutes, the whole system will power off to save you, to save your battery lives. Okay, this is the storage box. All of them have this building with a coach mount adapter and also a clamping system. Feels really nice. More importantly, did you see that there's extra space for your accessories? So this is something that even a DJI microphone that didn't come with this feature. So this is what I love about the Fulham 1000 Pro because it's a small and compact charging box, but also fits some of the audio accessories right inside this box. Here are Type-C port on the side, you can charge. You can charge the charging box with five watts at two amps. So altogether 10 watts charging input. So this is all the cables you're gonna get inside the box. First, a wind muff. Well, wind muff have, uh, this wind muff have a very special design. It's a cylindrical rubberized wind muff. Because when you take a look at the design of the, uh, the condenser microphone on the transmitter, it's a round shape cylindrical design, so it fits nicely with rubber. So it's a, it's a rubber 
a rubberized cylindrical cover that could fit really tight anti-slipper design on this condenser microphone that will make this wind mouth shield an all-in-one piece design. Even wearing a wind mouth, the transmitter itself is still quite small and compact. One receiver, two transmitter system, so it comes with two extra lavalier microphone. The lavalier microphone is a windshield clamp and it built with TRS TRS socket. So you can fit nicely in this. There's a whole system for a single transmitter. A cylindrical rubberized design wind foam that fits really tight and robust on the library microphone system. So this is, looks like it's pretty identical with some other brand, but there's some very unique in the, the detail that definitely improve the overall experience. This is a, a normal USB-A to C the charging cable. TRS to TRS socket, both with a 19 degrees angle, and it fits one of them on the side of your, uh, take a look, on the side of your receiver, and you can insert the other side into your uh, mirrors or uh, DSR cameras or video recorders. This one is a C to C cable. You can, you can actually, so this is a very unique design. Actually for the receiver, the type C port could also be doubled as a digital audio output. So to speak, you can transmit the audio files from this receiver to your Android phones or to your uh, MacBook, to your iPad Pro, which all of these devices come with a USB-C socket. The Fulham 1000 Pro even come with a digital cable for the iPhone, a lightning to the USB-C, the OTG cable. So this is something that feels really nice in the package. This is a pretty unique design. And this is what I one of the killer feature for the Fulham 1000, the lovelier microphone system. The charging box itself is small, it's light, but also with plenty of space to carry accessories right inside this box with magnetic design. This is the number one highlight of this ecosystem. Number two, that this lovelier microphone system could output the audio not only from this analog output, but also from the Type-C, the digital port. The, this one is widely compatible with your laptop, the PC or Mac, Android or the uh, iOS devices. So this is a fully compatible across all of the different platforms. And also with a number three is nicely built wind muff design. Not only on this condenser microphone on board, but also on this lovelier microphone that you get for free in the package as well. Just want to share with you some basic hands-on experience on this wireless microphone system. Because when you really put them in your real-world shooting scenario, you might come across with some really special design in the software. This is a Fulham 1000 Pro, which the Pro relies as a two transmitter and one receiver. Every one of them has a coach mail adapter with anti-twisted rubber and a unique shape to add more frictions when you put on the coach mount, no matter on your a clamp or your coat shoe. When your LED lights stop blinking, that is when they get fully connected to each other, to the receiver. And aside, you also might come across with a screen indication that the channel one and channel two also get to notice the remaining battery life for each transmitter and receiver itself. Well, they also get a signal stress icon on the side. And for the receiver itself, you also get two extra buttons. It's a volume button and an extra interesting filters that built inside this receiver. There's also another killer feature for this modern microphone system. Here, if you single tap on this volume button, you can see you have different volume gain. One, two, three, four, four different steps. And I also get to see the real time volume on the screen with very high refresh rate. You might see the, the yellow zone and the red zone. So you have to change or adjust the volume 
for inside this receiver to acquire the minimal, the optimal audio level and put them into your uh, mirrorless microphone or mirrorless cameras. If you single tap on the power on button on the transmitter, you would switch in between the mute and unmute. Take a look. Now the channel 2 has been mute. Tap and you are good to go. On the side, this is an analog output that definitely transfer the audio to your camera via this port and also get the camera icon, which is very user friendly. Uh, on the other side, you get output for the digital audio that has a phone icon on the side. And this one comes with headphone because you can mount a headphone system to monitor the audio in the real time. And if you tap on the external filter, you can switch back in between the different modes. There's a low cut filter, it's active noise cancellation, and this is a KTV echo, the audio filter that builds the audio effects right inside this little audio transmitter. In the coming next, we're gonna put this virus microphone into the real world to take some sample shot to literally show you the real power of the audio performance uh, in the, the camera system, in the mobile phone system, and even more use cases for your reference. Okay, here I do have some extra bonus tips for this wireless microphone system. Take this one for example. This is C2C cable. It's a USB OTG audio cable. So the cable come in a package that cannot charge, cannot charge this uh, wireless microphone receiver. Let's take a test. Take a look. When you plug and play, it's not charging. But when you power on this receiver itself, you might notice that it's a USB icon on the bottom and this remaining battery life. So this receiver is actually transfer the audio to my laptop, but at the same time, you cannot recover the battery on the go. But when I switch back to the another, another cable designed by Deity, which also I have shared with you in my previous video. This cable has a better design that you can see that could, with this cable, you can transfer the audio files via the USB port. At the same time, you can charge this audio receiver itself. This is a hybrid, this is a hybrid connector that you can charge the receiver itself, at the same time, transfer the audio from the receiver to your camera or laptop. I recommend you purchase one of this cable. This is also a very cost-effective cable designed by DT. I think this is one of the best companion with the Fulham 1000 Pro, and I suggest in the future package that Fulham substitute this C2C OTG audio cable to this full functional C2C audio and power hybrid cable. Okay, here is a basic audio performance test um, via this USB C to C cable. And cable connect this Fulham 1000 Pro, this one receiver to my MacBook Pro. The, now I am sharing with you the screen capture. And I use a C to C, the digital audio connector that record audio directly in the screen capture video. Brand not only design and manufacture the wireless lavalier microphone system, but also have some really unique accessories. In this section, not only you get to know the audio performance in real world, but also get to sketch about this brand and, and its unique accessories. Here, for example, on the best sellers, the Fulham WM500 is an exceptional UHF wireless lavalier microphone system that was one receiver, four transmitters that can record four different channels. The next one is a full length bone microphone cable compatible with the, you know, compatible with the Bose. There's a universal compatibility that is still designed is ideal for this Bose Quiet Comfort Mark One and Mark Two. So they literally utilize this 2.5 millimeters plug and convert to the. 3.5 plug at the same time they add an extra microphone 
And they also have some uh, USB-C, the livelier LiPo microphone system, a wireless livelier microphone system that they build with the Type-C port. This is a basic overview about the brand Fullam. I hope you can learn something about this brand and also get to evaluate the real-world audio performance with the digital audio cable to my laptop. Next up, we're going to test the Fullam 1000 Pro on my Android phone. This is my basic setup. A wireless microphone receiver on the top of the coach mount, but I substitute this C2C cable recording the video. At the same time, I'm now charging this receiver at the same time. So this is a great option for the wireless microphone system, and the dirty C2C cable can deliver a better experience compared to the official C2C audio cable. Okay, I am now using the Android phone, the native camera, and the cable connect with this wireless microphone system. I turn off my background light, and I gonna hear this. It is a light preview screen on my phone. Take a look. I'm going to hit record. Now my phone is now recording at 1080p with front-facing camera, and this is a the Xiaomi 12 Pro, this Android phone, and by default, it will capture the audio from this wireless microphone system. Okay, turn on, turn down the over, it's overexposed. Now, it looks better. This phone, this phone, this Android phone, tend to use the external microphone once it detects this wireless microphone system inserting this USB-C port. So this is the audio you've been captured, you're hearing at this moment, has been captured with the wireless microphone system. Take a look. You can change the, the different, you can change the, the different audio filter by tapping the button, tapping the button on the side. You tap the button, you can now switch back. Now it is a low cut filter. It's a low cut filter, tap again, it is an active noise cancellation. Just to make a side by side comparison before and after, if we use some digital signal processing technology that's built right inside this wireless receiver that perform just like your phone, the air plug, to actively denoise in real time. When you tap again, this is a, the KTV echo effect. It's an echo effect. Things got a little more interesting, I suppose. And you might probably use this feature as when you live, you perform live on TikTok, you perform live on YouTube or some other platform, and add the audio effects in real time. So this is all overall experience on my Android phone. Well, it works pretty identical on the iPhone, but luckily enough, the Fullam 1000 Pro also deliver a free lightning to USB-C cable in the package, so to speak. It looks, it works literally the same via this lightning connector, but when has, you have mounted this cable on the iPhone, your wireless receiver will not get charged via this lightning connector. So this is something you must have bear in mind. The native camera on the iPhone also automatically capture the audio from the external device, such as the full and one sound pro. Coming next, let's take a rough test. I am now recording with iPhone front-facing camera with HDR video format and the audio you're hearing all comes from this Fulham 1000 Pro, the system, and it looks like the iPhone delivers a better video quality compared with the Xiaomi Android phone. And the audio you're hearing at the moment all comes from this microphone and uh, if you tap, you can switch back in between normal the low cut filter, as well as the active noise cancellation. But what fascinates me most is, is the KTV echo effect. It looks pretty magical. We can add some effects in real time and deliver to an audience. And how about action cameras like the DJI Action 3? As you might have noticed, it is also working on the DJI Action 3. I use a C2C cable. Not only the Fulham 1000 Pro could get charged via this cable, but also could deliver the audio in real time and save to this uh, portable, high-quality action camera. 
and it's, that is to say it is also compatible with GoPro and Insta360 cameras as well. Here's some bonus tip on DJI Action 3. Take a look. Here on the, the menu, the back side, you have to tap to this audio capture and change the internal gain. For example, I, I have pre-choose the, the 2 dB and I also set the internal gain for this microphone system as the level 1. With this comparison, will give you the best overall audio quality on the DJI Action 3. Now let's take a look. And uh, you know this is a wide angle field of view and it's uh, the, the one of the best camera for every vlog. Let's take a look. Audio you're hearing at the moment all come from the DJI Action 3 and the Fulham 1000 Pro. I intentionally turn on the KTV echo effect. Just want to show you the real world audio performance in this combo set. And I can easily switch back in between the different audio effects. It is normal, the normalized video. This is a low cut filter. And this is an active noise cancellation. And this is a KTV echo effect. We also add some very interesting audio effects with the action camera like the DJI Action 3. So this is the overall test for the Action 3 and the Fulham 1000 Pro, just for your reference. Oh yes, by the way, if you are interested in my setup on the Action 3, you might probably take a notice that this is a magnetic coat shoe mount, coat shoe mount accessory for the DJI Action 3. I will put this video accessory, the link down in my description so you can get your hands on this super cool tiny little accessory for the DJI Action 3. Clamp and you get an extra coat shoe. Clamp, you get an extra coat shoe bottom of this combo set. I do hope you can learn something from this video and get a great overview on this brand Fulham, especially on this Fulham 1000 Pro, the wireless microphone system designed for video content creators. And if you found this video helpful, please don't forget to thumb up, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. Talk to you soon. See you next time. Bye.